95.5 KLOS Breakfast with the Beatles. It is our birthday today. <laughs> 30 years young. Bringing Southern California Beatles on a Sunday. My name is Chris Carter. We're having a little party here. And uh, thanks everybody for coming down today. Especially this man to my right, Mr. Rob Christie. He used to Man, normally you don't have to be nervous in radio because nobody watches you. There's a yeah. <laughs> hundred people in this room now. I'm freaking out. Yeah. Rock and Rob Christie used to work with Deirdre O'Donoghue. When did you start working? Do you remember the? Uh, it was in the '90s. Yeah, um, a, a couple of years with spent with her, driving her to and from work every day. Yeah, how did you how did you hook up with Deirdre? I hooked up because of uh, well, I was doing the Capitol Records catalog at the time, and she needed a producer for the show, so. Uh, a friend just hooked her, hooked us up, and uh, you know, clearly, I, I love the Beatles, and I, I was aware of the catalog, and it, somebody just hooked us up, and she hired me. Hold so, on for a minute, Morley. Yes. You know, I'd like a little piano during the interviews today, right? You know, <laughs> we're paying you by the hour, okay? So I, cocktail hour. No, no time for you to have brandy and eggnog. It's this is this is when you're on, my friend. <laughs> oh, that's nice. Isn't that nice? Cosmo Topper and his happy talking piano. Calms me down now a little bit. <laughs> so, Rob, you've uh, not only worked with Deirdre O'Donoghue, but you've been a good friend to the show when I've been the host, bringing in various guests over the years. Yeah, and you know what's neat is to see Jackie, Jackie DeShannon and uh, Peter Asher here because doing the Capitol They Records came together. Catalog. Did you notice that? They came together? I did. Something, it, something up over there. <laughs> so I used to be able to work on their catalog as well. It's neat to see everybody here. And, it uh, is. And Mickey's coming in. And, uh, and we've got some fine food from Steve and the Village Pizzeria. And uh, oh, I love Village some Pizzeria. great bagels here. We have an espresso bar. We'll, we'll get the guys here on air to plug their various eateries. Oh, uh, I brought tons of stuff to give away, too. Oh, you did, did in. you? Yeah, like, Working with the Fab Four, I see. Like their Christmas CD we're giving away, too. So, so Rob, when I was going through the old clips of Dear Joe Donio, I actually found one that might put a smile on your face. Engineer Mark, hit that. Wow. No, that's not it. <laughs> it's uh, number um, five on that other CD. On, on CD two. There it is. I have to tell you, having Rob Christie helping me with Breakfast with the Beatles has been a treat to load these last few months. He came in a couple of minutes ago just as I started to do the commercials and said, uh, you gonna play 1985? And I said, uh, I, any particular reason and he just looked at me with this wonderful look he gets on his face and said because it rocks